Well, I just broke my uh, bandsaw blade. So I'll have to. Uh, I'm going to join it, and I don't. Uh, I don't use a welding. I just uh, braise it with, uh, with silver solder and uh, silver solder and some flux. Okay. This is the little jig I made up a few years ago. And I just uh, just clamped this little jig right there. This little jig, uh, there's only something just made up and there's a magnet there that keeps the, the parts from, from being lost. And I, and this little jig is, uh, as you can see, is just a couple of pieces of uh, angle iron with a couple of little screws in it. And uh, I just set it up on the edge right there. Now I got it uh, set up. So, as you can see, I did this one before. So you just clean it all up, two ends, grind it down 10 or so degrees on, on each end, long air, and lay it down into those little channels right there. So I'll set that up. Okay. So set that up in the the thing now, and I'll clean it all up first. There and I put another piece of bandsaw blade in on top of this one just to hold it in place so when you screw the screw in it won't move. Just screw it in tight and just take this one here. Now I got a 10 degree bevel up this way on this one and down that way on that one. And you just put it in, it's got to be 90 degrees right across the blade. Okay, we're ready now to uh, solder, do the solder joint. So that one there is not, this one here is not tight yet. Just leave that one a bit loose until it gets the solder ready to go. And then we'll just push it together and tighten it off after. So that way everything will be, this one over on the right is, is tight. It's starting to melt right now. So we just push over on it a little bit. There you go. Now the joints just fuse right together there now. Perfect. Yep, it's good to go there now. Just leave that. That one there is a wee bit slack. So. Now, that looks good. Let her cool. My silver solder, you can get that jeweler somewhere. And now I want us to uh, grind off the, the bump. And this is a little meat saw that I got here, so make sure that the 
the blade cuts the right way when you put it on. So I'm going to try it there now. Give it in. I'll put it on anyway. Okay, now the blade is on. All I got to do now is put some tightness in it. Do that on the back. Screw the it up tight. There's the join right there. So we got to see now. Oh, he's going to pass through the bearings right there. So you can see there's a bit of a bump there. Yep, a little bit out. Okay. The blade is on and not, not uh, making too big of contact and it's really tight so yeah I'll try it. Okay this is a piece of uh, maple. I just cut out and this uh, run through free ant right there sir out <laughs>